I'm a co-founder of March for Our Lives, and I am also a freshman at Georgetown University. I'm here for the women in my family that were able to attend secondary education, as well as pursue their dreams because they had access to abortion. I'm also here because I'm a survivor of gun violence, and it pains me every single fucking day that a gun has more rights than I do. They work harder to protect guns than they work to protect women. Before I begin, I want to re-emphasize that abortion care is not just for women. It is for non-binary people, trans people, everyone who can fucking have a child. Have you guys ever seen the beginning of Handmaid's Tale? Because this shit feels like it. Like a lot. Like it's absolute bullshit. Um, but it basically, I can't even, I'm sorry, but, <laughs> you got it. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> okay, don't be fooled, overturning Roe versus Wade is more about just forcing people to give birth, it's about controlling people and keeping people in a system that keeps them down and continues to let poor people be stuck in cycles of poverty. <laughs> okay, also, the men in that building, two of them have been incredibly... Well, I'm sorry. Accused of sexual assault. Uh, yeah, literally two of them have, have been accused of sexual assault. And I, I, literally, and I refuse to let them fuck with any more of us. One of the most frightening aspects of what Justice Alito, if I can call him justice, uh, yeah. fucking said, is that it says president, what's next? Right? They're going to come for gay rights, they're going to come for gay marriage, they're going to come for interracial couples. We cannot let that happen. <laughs> Although the news is heartbreaking, there's still hope. I mean, we're here, we're a fucking gorgeous generation. Look at us, we're hot as fun. Anyways, also, please vote. <laughs> Literally, please vote. Um, so there are many calls of action that other speakers are going to say here today and have said here today, but I think one that I want to say is to take care of each other. Take care of yourself, because I go to class every day and we talk about this and I have friends that burst out in tears, I burst out in tears, and we're not going to be able to fight this if we're all extremely exhausted. Yeah. 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 So let's make sure we're drinking water, getting sleep when we can, and finding joy in the little moments that we can. Um, and before I end, I want to also finish in a chant, if you guys can join me. Also, also, I want to say that abortion is still legal. You can still access abortion, so don't yep. think otherwise. Okay. Before I go, remember, this is what democracy looks like. That is what hypocrisy looks like. Ready, ready, ready? 